This video is about the update of my road project. I'm so sorry that I haven't had any videos for almost a week because I was really so busy doing documentation, paperwork. But this is what's happening with my road project. You can see the hardworking Susan. If he, she got vacant time, she comes here and do the sifting of the sand. The sand is actually saving me a lot of um, hassle of getting the sand because she is just doing it right on site and also the rubble that she is um, putting in right now is from the sifted sand so it is really economical for me that Susan is there so here we are on the road you can see we got rubbles here that's already been deposited and while we are at it Susan was sifting it to get sand out of it and the latest things that we have done, I'm sorry again for not having videos because I'm so busy with documentation, is we have extended the wall here on this side for three purposes. One is to make it more neat and tidy. Two is for privacy purposes. You don't want your neighbor's window looking through it. Also, we'll be doing the same, I think, on this side a little bit but not a priority since we will be now concentrating on the road. Although when Mars will be finished with this one, we could also extend this side here, just put a beam and then we'll continue on making it higher for more private road, you know, to make the road more private. You don't want the neighbor's window will be looking through the road and what's happening especially here that it needs to be tidied up so you can see that my lads has been putting beams welding welding it together and make it higher now and also while they're doing it the lads are also filling up some of the rubbles. We'll soon be leveling it all out to get the slope that we wanted because we'll be working on the road from now on. We are, we have experienced, um, what's the call this, a successive low pressure events here. That's why we have been having rains every afternoon for the last three weeks. So hopefully right now we won't have any rain. Then we will be concentrating on sorting the road. I want this all be done properly. So in order for it to be done properly, we need to make sure that it's safe, it's private, and also um, I don't... I just like it neat and tidy, you know? That's why I want it to be secure, safe, and private, you know? Like, yeah, I just want it all neat and tidy. I don't want to be seeing the what are the neighbors are doing because you can say they can actually see over and also decide soon. We'll be doing the file here as well. So to make it all covered up. Ato sa niya ning pailan niya diritan oy. Kay aron mabagay ba. Butangan na siya beam. Ha? Oh. Beam sa niya dayon patong. Mm. Tulo upat ana ba. Kuto ba nang abuhan sila mi? Ah. Ra gay ang scene. So I was telling Jonathan that we will be doing the same on this side. Otherwise, it won't balance out. And it will be rendered, of course. And then, But I just... You will see that I am really doing this. So, for aesthetics. And also for safety. And also for privacy. So that's the main three reasons why I'm sorting the road here it's all connected with the cross beams that we have put in down here and you can see we poured the color we poured the base of this 
um, wall and then put a big beam on the top then before we pile up the next blocks so we are now pouring the walls and we'll soon be rendering this as well you notice that um my scaffold is the gift from old B for my anniversary grip that I asked from him is really useful to me. So I even have one comment from a subscriber, not comment really, he messaged me that he was really shocked that I like metal scaffold where it in Asia on based on his experience that they don't seem to like the metal scaffold but look how easy it is to transfer how easy it is to keep away i mean no need for them to spend the whole day nailing on to a new scaffold so there's jonathan's gonna be transferring it here and so work will not be hindered and that's the reason why i like metal scaffold i told him i'm fed up with using wood and bamboo so this is our road progress and soon we'll be leveling out more dirt and we will be doing our first maybe September the pour on this side the first pour of the road hopefully or October like I said I don't want it I don't want it to be rush I want it to be perfect that while you do it once you do it right because that's my you know my motto for any of my build is you do it once you do it right and you can see that the vegetation around here on my development has grown up again because like i said we've been having for the last three weeks we have rains every afternoon not just rain like heavy rains it causes a lot of flooding in the city we're lucky here we don't have that because of where on the hill it flows down but here we are we're gonna be sorting out this weeds again but we can't concentrate on that we are concentrating on our first face of the road so all the markings for each plot has now been officially marked officially been measured and officially been submitted to the bureau of lands for listing of the uh, new owners of the different plots so that's also one thing that i'm sorting that's why i'm not having a lot of videos but thank you for all my subscribers and followers that still, despite with no videos, I've noticed that my channel is still slowly growing. People are still watching my old videos. Thank you so much. And you will soon see I'll be making a few more videos when I got the time. I'm just so busy, you know, up to my neck with all the things that I have to do, especially documentation wise with all the project going on with me i'm also sorting out the building permit of one of the plots here that entails a lot of documents to be presented together with the building permit application so it's still been on the drawing board right now and i'm sorting out the paperwork on that one there's a lot needed and people to sign on the different areas like the electrical area you need that clearance from the electrical company here and the plumbing all oh, loads of seven departments that you need to have clearances for application of building permit but it's ongoing now i have um hired an architect and whole sort all that for them So we're going to add more rubble here as we go on 
and Susan's already been through to the last two mounts or two truckloads that's been poured over here this is actually six and they are slowly putting it on the road and it's just need leveling up then off we go do tamper the whole thing and then get the slope